good to be here. Um, I have a boyfriend. <laughs> Brag. Um, it's good because I was getting very desperate. Like, a guy would send me one text, I'd be like, what are we? <laughs> He'd be like, I'm your Uber driver, I'm outside. <laughs> I'm like, oh, so you've got a car. <laughs> My boyfriend is great, he's amazing, but he is, um, he is a nerdy little loser. Uh, no, but I, I love that about him, right? When we first moved here to Melbourne, we were on the plane, I see he was using like the airplane Wi-Fi to search the phrase, Australian singles. I was like, what is this bastard up to? <laughs> Haven't even arrived yet, he's trying to cheat on me in advance. I asked him about it, I was like, why are you searching that? He's like, oh. I'm trying to find a website where I can buy single Yu-Gi-Oh trading cards. <laughs> I was like, oh, that's so much worse. <laughs> Wish he was cheating, you know. <laughs> well, it's, it's good to have hobbies. <laughs> I always think I don't have enough hobbies. You know, I don't know if you ever think that about yourself, like, oh, I need to, I need to spend my time better, I don't have enough hobbies. But then sometimes I'll see someone and I'll be like, oh, no, actually, I'm fine. <laughs> I realised this when I was buying eggs on the Woolworths website. This, this joke isn't sponsored. Um, <laughs> but, yeah, I was getting my Woolies worth um, <laughs> from the fresh food people. And <laughs> the reason I mention Woolworths is because you can check this when you get home. I was buying eggs, and I saw that the eggs that I was buying had a rating of 4.2 stars. There's people out there spending their time <laughs> reviewing eggs. <laughs> it, it shocked me. Why do you need to review an egg? It's an egg. Like we, we get the gist. You know, who's having an egg, a food that's been around unchanged for thousands of years and thinking, I've got some notes. <laughs> if you could pass this on to the chicken. <laughs> the chicken passes that on to the egg. And so on and so forth. Who's reviewing eggs? 500 people. 46 pages. I read them all. I, I've got a lot of time on my hands. Because the reviews for the egg are what you'd expect a review for an egg to be. One of them just said, tasted the same as any other egg. <laughs> Three stars. I was like, that's a good egg in my books. The five-star reviews are even more illuminating because those people had an egg and had an amazing experience. <laughs> but there were 4.2 stars overall, which got me a little bit upset because last year in the comedy festival, the Age newspaper rated my show four stars. <laughs> I got beaten by a fucking egg. Now every time I have an egg, I get tall poppy syndrome. I'm like, <laughs> look who's beating who now. Thanks very much, guys. I'll be Melody Bracelet for